I thought rap music was a platform where you could express your views and feelings to the people and tell them what you feel or if there are any society problems that you want to solve, you can actually talk to the people directly on one to one. Mapumbano, Bado, Yana and Delaya, Vutaniku Vutanima Ishiyaki Bongo, Richa Wangi wanna check a rick and tower congo manzesi, paka karako, what to wanna pig a mizi go, so tiny sawa in gawa wenga na disabu si you sawa, sawa sawi ya, u kwali sesa mimi na kumbiya. Hey yo, siku zina pita, vita vinaita Bamesha mtanga nika mwenye kika kusikika Kuwika zaida fika maik na shika mshika 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 Mimi nika hapa na pa usika Na vanusu wika kifo cha uzunika Na kipa na kita kwenye fani kamo sita Who's next? Iyi kuwabana labda watu wa siyonge kuhusu labda mambo mengine Sometimes inakuwa ni vizuri sometimes inakuwa ni vibaya inaweza ikawa ni vizuri kama nimetukana matusi kama anayosema sinazi hii lakini inaweza ikawa ni vizuri kama mimi nimeongelea kuhusu siasa nimeongelea labda nikasema TRP is good than in CCM si, radio ni aweza kapiga hata siku moja nyimbo kama hiyo when i want like to talk about something that that is real no matus no what inside I don't choose, I, I just write it and I, I talk about it, I perform it, even though sometimes they don't play on the radio, I don't care. You can check you, huh? <laughs> Swearing on the radio, oh, on a, on, a, on a record, it's like, the way the government see it, if you tell them the truth, they're going to hate it. If you're going to swear, they're going to hate it. So the truth and the swearing put it in the same group, even though you're, selling the, you're saying the truth. So, you know, there's some other things that are so hard to say. You know, I, I don't know how the government are judging this, but that's the way it is. Yeah. Ili kwa elimike zaidi Ho, koko liko na wika na bwata kata kata pata pata mambo Sepeke de bla bla ni barwa na leta kara analiza Ni na baba waja kwenye maiki wa bantu wana nuna wana guna Wasere mana atonesha na wagusa nyoyo yao Na sasa na pikisa na misasa hasa kisa na mukasa Nipale ni napone na taratibu jinsi ukimuna vwa maliza kuwa liza liza watu Najua mziki ni mziki wote ule utakaweza kuyateka mawazo yako na kusikiliza ule mziki. Ujua mziki ni mzuri. Na wengine wanokiangalia kama jinsi mimi ninavyokwenda magonjwa muona mambo kama ubakaji yanatokea. Abushi pale unapokuepo mtu anakuepo katika wale watumia wale kwa pale. Lazima kuna mmoja kati ya ndugu yake alifanyike kitu kama hicho ubakaji. Kwa lazima kimuume. We usually love listening to reality based rappers who talk about things that are actually happening in the society and how we can change and transform the society into a better place so that we can all live in. I mean, hip hop shouldn't be all about I shot your mom, fuck your mom, fuck your dad. It shouldn't be all that. I mean, there's more to life than just that. People are dying out there in the streets of cold, children are out there in the street, people are getting executed in countries. We need to really bring our messages out in our rhymes and tell people what's going on and how we can change the world and make it a better place so we could all live in. Neno la tatu na la nne si panyaki na po kwenda mimi san wa ambacho da kisi e wengi wali kudia ili bili ni wa fishi ni katishi ni kachia lao ni haki kisha wapi dili na sosi bi mimi mweleke upi kweli au ni subi limpaka lijezali wakati hadi atari ina kabili. Na tumepata support nzuri kwa sababu kwa nyimbo kama kifo tunongelea mambo kim watu sana ma condoms tumesha fanya na ukazi tumesha nda na watanga. Tumenda nao morogoro. Yani na tunende wa tunaperform. Sio kwa watoto wa vijana. Tunaperform kwa waze. Wameka mawaziri wameka. Tunaimba njimba kifo mtu anatoka. Anaomba hato mlete kopie ulio yandika. The Salama condom is one of the PSI products. And um, our policy is um, we have targets. We have the youth who have not used the condom at all. We have youth who are sexually active. And we have those who are not youth, but maybe mature adults who have experience with a condom. And um, we try to reach all these people all over Tanzania. 
uh, by social marketing this condom. Some examples of um, projects that I have done marketing the Salama condom, basically at the very beginning, maybe 1995, I did the very first um, youth and talent awareness show where I brought in some youth I knew were very good rappers like the Diplomats, for example, when they came out. And we did, uh, they were youth and they were talented, but then I wanted to take them also to a bigger crowd of people who love them through the radio by creating awareness of AIDS. That is one of the examples. After taking rap into radio, I noticed an incredible effect. Fortunately, I also became a VJ, television DJ with ITV, that's also Radio 1. The effect was massive. The first concert I did myself in 1995 attracted over 700 youth. Yes, rap has an effect. 700 youth and you can teach them and they can enjoy and they can stay there for four hours and clap and shout. That is an effect you want. Attention for SIDA, attention for AIDS, Jiazari na ukimi ni hatari. Kimi una uwa, una teza familia za tuweka, baba, mama, kimi una uwa. Yatima wana zidi, wana bai kutiseka, taifa ya puteza watu, bila ya idadi, Jiazari, jichunge. Wacha washa rati, tutepungu za ukimi, na mwishu toko meza hapa kweli Tanzania, AIDS. A, A, H, E, ini uwe, D, dawa, A, C, na, dogo, dogo, C, H, AIDS. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Basata kama taasisi ambayo inasimamia wasanii na idara yetu sisi ambayo idara ya muziki tuliona umuhimu kwanza wa kuwatambua hawa vijana na fani yao hii ya muziki wa rap. Sasa baada ya kuwatambua na kuwasajili tulitizama umuhimu wa mziki huu katika kuelimisha jamii ambapo ni rahisi sana katika kufikisha ujumbe lakini pia kuburudisha. Bahati nzuri kama mlivyoona katika muziki wao rap wanajieleza katika maendeleo kwanza wanaelezea jamii maisha ya jamii eh? sasa katika maisha ya jamii kuna matatizo na mafanikio kwa vijana wanapoimba wanaimba matatizo wanaimba mafanikio na mimi nasema Afrika kwa sababu tulipo nilipokuwa mdogo ne, kuna nyimbo fulani kuna rap fulani zilizo zinafanywa na na, na, na wacheza ngoma wakati wanacheza ngoma na msi tuko bado wadogo na bado nakumbuka zile rap zenyewe walizokuwa naziimba mm. eh yeah. kwa hiyo baada ya kusikiliza zile rap zinazo wanavyo rap na hapo nikauanisha na zile za huku nyuma walizokuwa naona niku wanasikia basi nikaona kwamba kumbe rap ilikuepo tangu zamani mm. eh yeah. uko kwa tintu kuane uko kwa tintu kuane no mama tintu kuane tukuana lale na mayo tukuana lale na mama ubaba tintukuane ubaba tintukuane atintukuane 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 tukuana lale na mama tukuana lale na mama nuku kwa tintukuane atintukuane atintukuane manake anasema babu sio ndugu yangu na bibi sio ndugu yangu anasema kama babu ni ndugu yangu kwa nini alale na na bibi basi ilikuwa kama hivyo kama mtani utani wa namna hmm. eh <laughs> kwa ushindani wa vyombo vya habari uliopo ndio changamoto kubwa ambayo sasa imefanya hata radio Tanzania ambayo ni ni ni, ni ya serikali i mean state of state of eh? system yao badala ya kupiga tu muziki wa kawaida huwa i mean local bands wamebadilisha sasa wanaingia kwenye muziki wa rap si katika mazingira gani bali ni kuwavuta vijana kuna vipindi maalumu mfano kuna kipindi cha vijana ambacho kinatoka kila Jumamosi I mean every Saturday kuanzia saa moja mpaka saa mbili. it's one hour program na hiki kipindi kinadhaminiwa na wizara ya kazi na maendeleo ya vijana lakini wengine anaweza kakujia alafu kakuuliza ni aina mada gani anatakiwa kutunga mziki wake na ni wazi kwamba unapotaka kutunga kitu uangalie topic na topic should be current nafikiri na kwa nzuri kama ni madawa ya kulevya madawa ya kulevya sasa hivi mambo ya environmental has been a glo global issue inazungumzwa kwa maybe unatunga mziki kuhusu mambo ya mazingira 